In this problem, we're going to convert this number to base 4. To do this, we're going to just repeatedly divide by 4 and write down the remainders. And the remainders will be our answer. So we'll start by taking 1, 1, 0, 2, 8, and dividing by 4. So I'm going to put this into my calculator. 1, 1, 0, 2, 8, divided by 4. So I got 2, 7, 5, 7. So the remainder is 0, right? There's nothing left over. Now, if you don't know that, what you can do is write it as 0. And then what you always do is you take this number and multiply it by 4 like this. And that's the remainder. Okay, so always just take the decimal part and multiply it by 4, and that gives you the remainder. Let's do it again. So now you take this number and divide it by 4. You always take the whole number part and divide by 4 like this. So let's do it. 2757 seven, divided by 4. So I got 689.25. So now you see there is a decimal there. And just like before, you, you take this number and multiply it by 4. 0.25 times 4. So 0.25 times 4, which is 1. So the remainder is 1. Okay, the remainder will always be 0, 1, 0, 1 2, or 3 in this problem. So let's do it again. And you take 689. So take this one. And divide it by 4. So basically you just keep taking the whole number part and dividing by 4 over and over again. You stop when this part is 0. So that'll happen uh, at some point. Let's see. So this is 172, 172.25. So now you take this part and multiply it by 4. And so we get 1. Then you do it again. Right? Take this part, 172, divide it by 4. 172, divide it by 4. So this is, let's see what we get. Oh, I got 43.0. So the remainder is zero. But again, if you wanted to follow the, the steps, you would just do this and you'd get zero. Then you do it again, except you take 43. So 43 divided by four. So this is 10.75. You know, you could do some of this in your head too. Like, you know, 43, uh, four goes into 43 10 times and three is left over, so the remainder is three. But this is just a way uh, that you can write it down and just like follow the steps so that you can always get it right. Because sometimes it's hard to do in your head, right? So see, three. Then you go to the next one, 10. 10 divided by four. This time the remainder should be two, right? Four goes into 10 uh, twice, and you have two left over. But let's, let's work it out, let's see. 10 divided by four, I got 2.5. Then you take the decimal, so, so 0.5, multiply it by 4, which is which is 2. Then you do it again, 2 divided by 4, right, take this number, divided by 4, so 2 divided by 4, this is 0 0.5. So now you stop, this is the last step because um, this is 0. So you, you repeat this process until you get 0 here, and then you just do 0 0.5 times 4, which is 2. Okay, now you write them backwards, 2. 2, 3, 0, 1, 1, 0. And then you put like a subscript like this, and you just write 4. And that should be the final answer. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.